so hi it's been forever since I've made you a video um I've just been really busy and like haven't had the brain power to make you something creative so um I kind of got an excuse to make you one because I bought some things so um I feel like all I show you is what I buy but I mean that's what I would do if we were together in person anyway so and I'm gonna see you in person very soon because you're going home this Friday I'm gonna be home midweek next week so we can hang out <laughs> and have our party. Um, but anyway, let's just jump right into it. Um, <clears throat> I have a few things um, that I've picked up here and there over the past few weeks. And um, I will start with my Makeup Forever Professional HD Foundation because you already know about it. But I figured I'd like show it to you and everything. It would be really exciting. So I've only, um, I just got it last night. And I used it this morning. However, I woke up wicked late and I was like 15 minutes late for class I've never been late for class before in my life and I was freaking out um but um I, so I put it on like really fast this morning and I've been like in the library like going like this all day so it's not really on um my blush is still on I guess it's actually on it's like a really good foundation <laughs> can withstand my hand touching of the face um, so anyway, I'll sh get on. Oh, no. Um, so I'll get on with it. This is the foundation. Ooh, that's too close. This is the foundation's box. Um, Makeup Forever Professional HD Foundation. High definition. And, um, I was planning on just getting the Revlon color stay again because I love it so much. But, um, even that color is a little off for me. Um, it's pretty close. Um, but it's not exactly my skin color. Because, like, if you look at my arms and then look at my face, like, this is pretty close. Um, the Revlon color stay, there was a bit of a difference, um, which bothered me. So, and if I wasn't, like, really careful to blend out onto my neck, it would look stupid. Um, it was pretty close, though. But anyway, let me say how many times I can say pretty close. Um, so, um, I stopped in Sephora just in case I wanted, um, I saw something, and I did. I was like, oh, I've been meaning to try that anyway, so this is a great opportunity. Um, so, of course, I got the lightest shade, um... This is the packaging. It has a pump, which I like. I like that a lot, especially, er, I don't know how good that will, will be when I get low on the product. I don't know if you can take the, t the cap off or not. I don't know. Um, but it's, it's really awesome. And I was like reading about it and it has, um, here, let me read the box to you so I don't ramble. Um, Here, HD foundation combines flawless coverage and an extremely natural finish. The Cerasite contained in HD foundation heightens the diffusion of light and intensifies the glow of the skin. Um, enriched with relipidium, HD foundation moisturizes and prepares the skin for makeup. In you, it's, oh my God. I'm so brain dead right now. Hold on. It's unusually smooth and elastic texture, makes it easy to apply and a pleasure to wear. Skin texture is refined to give a very natural complexion. We got a computer sound. I don't know if you can see on my, uh, see it doesn't even look like I'm wearing foundation really, does it? I have it on. Um, I have so many blemishes right now, by the way. It's so embarrassing. I have like the perfect little like bendy zit right there. It's really cool. Um, I can't even cover it up with foundation or concealer. Um, that's fine though. So I'm really excited about my new foundation. Um, cause I have been wearing foundation on a daily basis lately. Um, I don't really know why. I also purchased at Sephora, um, do this little mini pack of wet wipes. It's just like express cleansing wipes here, there, anywhere. Um, <laughs> uh, it's, uh, just like a mini pack. I can use this if I like need to remove my makeup when I'm not home. Um, and it fits in my makeup bag, so that's cool. And it was like $4, and you get how many wipes? Doesn't even say. I feel like it's supposed to. Oh, here, 10 wipes. It comes with 10 wipes. And then, um, at Sephora, I also got this mostly just because I got sucked in. Um, I don't ever clip my nails, as you know. I don't need to. I guess I could use it on my toenails. But I got a nail clipper because it's Hello Kitty. Little Hello Kitty nail clipper. How cute is that? Say like Hello Kitty. It's so cute. And um, so now I have a Hello Kitty nail clipper. Maybe it's just good to have in my Hello Kitty collection. 
even if I don't use it. And then um, I went to Muji again because I needed to get some uh, travel bottles because um, I've been packing my room up to go home and I find that um, I need some of those little bottles for products that like aren't... I definitely just cut myself off. So I had a strawberry. Anyway. <laughs> um, so I went to Muji to get some stuff. So I got that, but nothing too exciting. Um, but I did get this, which I think is really cool. And so I had, um, there's no, or here, no, there's no English translation on this, except for the, like, price tag on the, on the bin it was in. And, um, and it said, like, feminine razor. And I was like, what the fuck does that mean? And I was like, oh, it must be one of those, like, eyebrow shavers. So, so and I'm, I just ran out. So I was like, oh, I'll get some. So I get them, and they come in this cute little package, and I was like, oh, you, they're folded, but if, like, they're like this scary knife, it like opens like that, and it's just like, it like flips closed, and it's kind of creepy, but this razor is like, first of all, huge, second of all, it's so sharp, it's like, like no other eyebrow razor ever. So I went to Urban Outfitters, and didn't really need to go, but I did. And I got a few things. Um, I have managed to lose all my sunglasses or break them, which is really cool. So um, I just grabbed another pair of sunglasses because they were $10. And if it's $10, I don't feel so bad when I lose it. And there's some like tortoise shell Arabian style. Look how big my tongue is. I have a really big tongue. So I got those and they gave me this cute little baggie. Probably won't ever keep them in there because they have a case, but it's fun. I just drilled a little. And then, this is for Brandon actually because I have to send him. Uh, I have a few things for his care package and I haven't um, sent it yet. And I saw this and I was like, that should be part of it. So it's called Stuff Every Man Should Know. And it's like pocket sized. And it says, this pocket sized companion features everything a man should know, but probably doesn't. Um, and then I went to the sales section because that's my favorite section um, of every store. And um, I actually found a perfume. And it was $10 reduced from like 50 Pretty sure. Or no, $42. It's $42 from an urban out for an urban outfitter's perfume. That's so lame to me. Um, anyway, this one caught my attention because it's so fun looking. It's like a snow globe. Oh, I should probably tell you what it's called. It's called Winter Island. Yeah, Winter Island. And it's like a snow globe, see? Shook it up. I wonder if it sprays the glitter on you. That'd be fun. Um, and it's a little pump, and, and I want to describe it to you because it smells so good. It's like really florally and yummy. It says, the scent of a warm island breeze mixed with tropical florals whisked you or whisks you away from the chilly cold of winter. Winter Island is a sensational blend of island water accords with notes of tulip, lily, honey, honeysuckle, pink rose, and driftwood. It's really nice. I'm just gonna keep smelling it. <laughs> and they wrapped it in this fun tissue paper. How fun. And then last but not least, I grabbed this last moment, last minute at the checkout. And I haven't even opened it yet, so we're going to open it together. And it's the NYX Butt Naked Eyes. Um, and so it comes with 15 eyeshadows, 4 blushes, a bronzer, and 2 face illuminators. Oh my god, this is so exciting. I, I've never had any NYX products before, except my whole makeup trunk is a NYX. It's a NYX makeup trunk. You've, you've seen it. And um, so I'm really excited to try this. Oh my god, we're unwrapping it together. Are you so excited? <laughs> Ooh, it's like heavy. So this is it. This is the palette. Oh, you can see the computer screen. Hi! Um, okay, so I open it and it has a giant mirror and these colors are awesome. I just, I looked at the colors very, like, quickly when I was looking at the packaging and they looked good to me because I don't wear intense eyeshadow. I use neutral colors, so this is perfect for me. Oh my god, this is perfect. Oh, it's nice. I'll give you a little sneak peek here. This is like a pink, a white, and this is like a beigey kind of color. Ooh, this is pretty, but I don't know if I'll ever be able to wear it. Oh, I put it over the white. That was stupid of me. Here. Look how dark that is. It's like a dark, shimmery purple. 
And then there's like oh, blind or it's fine, right? You oh oh for fuck's sake. Oh it comes with little applicators. The ones that no one ever uses, you know. Um we'll just dump those out. And that piece of paper. I'm really struggling here, oh my god. Okay. Do you see them? This is awesome. This is really cool. I'm really excited about this. It has like a matte black, some grays. <coughs> Excuse me. Some really nice browns. Some really nice browns in here. <laughs> I think I'm so funny. Okay. And then I am going to get this all over the place. Uh, wipe it on the tissue paper. <laughs> okay. And then the bottom layer, wait, how do I open it? That, that's, Cody. How do I do other directions? <laughs> this shouldn't, oh, it slides out. <laughs> it slides. Whoa, look at this. It slides out. Cool. Okay, I'm going to carefully remove this piece of plastic. Cool, these blushes are so pretty. Uh, oh, I was wondering if they had names. Okay, so four blushes, bronzers, or bronzer, and then the illuminators. Ooh, these illuminators are really nice. This will be awesome for, like, traveling. You have fucking everything in one. Oh, my God. This is, like, my makeup look right here. All of this. This is perfect. This is awesome. I'm excited. Maybe if you respond positively to this, you'll get one. Maybe. I don't know if you'd ever use it. Have you been wearing your makeup? That looks good, right? <laughs> this is how you put a highlighter on, right? And then just blend all over. I've like really been not very good with my makeup lately. I've just been like slapping it on and Probably not a good idea. I'm so excited about this. Guess how much this was? Like nothing. It was $25. Like for all of this. And this is really good. And it's cruelty free. And hypoallergenic and lead free. I'm excited. I'll use this and I'll let you know how it goes. I might play with it after I get off of making this video. Anyway, I should probably go. I don't know how long this is. You're probably bored by now, um, but I'm going to go play with my makeup, and then I'm going to write some papers, some finals, and um, take a shower and go to bed. So I hope you enjoyed my video, and I miss you, and I'll see you so soon, and we're going to have a party. I should probably tell my mom about that. Um, yeah, that's about it. Okay, I love you, and I'll see you so soon. And I hope your finals are going well, and I hope you're not too stressed, but I know you are. But don't be, because it'll all be over soon, and you'll do great. Okay, bye!